Our 2023 River Osprey Cam at Blackwater National Wildlife Refuge has been a success so far this season. This video features highlights from the first three months. Our Osprey couple flew back separately from South America for their breeding season and both arrived at the nest on March 21st. Not long after, a third Osprey tried to land on the nest, but the couple drove it off. It's common for intruder Ospreys to test the resident couple at a nest. Soon after arriving, the couple started bonding, which often involves mating attempts as seen here. Not all mating attempts produce eggs. We have night vision on the river cam so we can see action after the sun goes down. Here a muskrat was swimming by the nest platform which sits in the Blackwater River. We also sometimes see snapping turtles and even river otters swimming by. We also caught one of the adults coughing up a pellet in the early morning. Pellets contain scales and bones from their fish meals that the ospreys can't digest. In the early weeks of the breeding season, the male brought fish to the female at the nest and showed he would be a good provider and worthy of being her mate for the nesting season. This is another form of bonding. Here the female grabs the fish from the male and flies off to eat it at her favorite perch. We also saw several other episodes where an intruder osprey tried to land on the nest. These birds are likely looking for a nest and possibly a mate and can sometimes become aggressive. Around April 19th, we noticed the female was sitting down in the nest as if she was on eggs. In addition, we noticed that when she left the nest, the male was taking her place as if he was also incubating, so it was clear that the couple had produced eggs. The adults must keep the eggs a certain temperature throughout the incubation process for the chicks to develop properly. In this clip, you can see that when the male sits on the eggs, he rocks back and forth to move the eggs near his brood patch, which helps keep his body heat against the eggs. We believe the first chick hatched on May 28th, the second on May 30th, and the final chick on June 1st. The first chick in a raptor nest is always the dominant chick and will peck its siblings to ensure it gets fed the most. Fortunately, our male osprey did a great job of bringing in loads of fish, so there was enough food to allow the youngest chick to thrive. In the early weeks of their lives, the chicks are too small to tear off food for themselves, so the female tears off pieces and feeds it to them. As the chicks get older and stronger, they'll start to reach over and attempt to pull off some meat by themselves. Once the chicks are fully grown and flying, the parents will eventually just drop off fish in the nest and let the chicks feed themselves. In most osprey nests, the female is the only adult who feeds the chicks, but sometimes you'll see an osprey nest where the male will help as well. Here you can see our male does occasionally feed the chicks. As the chicks develop their first set of feathers, they begin to practice flapping their wings as they work at building up the strength they'll need to one day fledge the nest. Both our parents have been outstanding this year, which is why all three chicks are thriving. Here you can see the female catch a big fish and feed the chicks through a summer rainstorm. It takes a lot of work to raise three hungry osprey chicks. If things go smoothly at the nest, we hope to see the chicks successfully fledge in the coming weeks. Stay tuned to the cam to catch all of the live action. And thanks for watching our 2023 River Osprey Cam, which is a project that is paid for and maintained by the Friends of Blackwater National Wildlife Refuge.